So, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, the truth of God message is just that. That's not right. It is for those that are hungry and thirsty mm -hmm. after righteousness. That's it. That's what this message is for. That's right. It's for all of them that are black, white, yellow, brown, and red who really mean what they say mm -hmm. that they don't want to go to hell. Amen. Amen. Uh, yeah, it's for them, for them, yeah. them that's playing around and want to play hopscotch into the kingdom <laughs> and all that stuff and think you can just get around and detour and bribe an angel and he can <laughs> get you into the kingdom and all these shortcuts. Yeah, uh, 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 uh. No, it's for them that fear God yeah. that's right. and really are free to go to hell. That's right. right. That's right. Amen. He that feareth God and worketh righteousness, Accepted. God says, is accepted with him. Mm -hmm. Now, I want to share with you a letter that we sent to the Supreme Court, each individual judge, mm -hmm. as a result of their wicked decision. Mm -hmm. There are some folk feel as though I should not have done that, and I don't care if you do feel that way. No. Some say, well, they wasn't bothering you. Oh, no. <laughs> Any time you're trying to change the commandment of God, mm -hmm. you're bothering all of God's people. Amen. 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 If there's one person that claim they are of God and they're not bothered by the decision Amen. of the Supreme Court, yeah. you are of your father, the yeah. devil. That's right. Now, the reason why some of you not bothered because you have a gay son, a gay daughter, a gay uncle, a gay father, a gay mother, a gay cuz, a gay pastor. Yeah. That's right. And you want to justify it because you have family members who love abomination. Yeah. That's right. That's right, sir. Have you noticed, brothers and sisters, practically every televised TV evangelist that got mega churches, the homosexual subject is off limits. That's right. Don't touch it, sir. That's right. Joel Austin won't touch it. Don't touch it, sir. Benny Hill, I mean, Benny Hinn. That's right. He won't touch it. Amen. Creffler, old nickel, old dollar. That's right. Don't touch it. He won't touch it. He won't touch it. T.D. Jakes no, won't touch it. No. Fred Price, why won't they touch it? Mm -hmm. Because to them, the homosexual money is as green as the street. That's, That's right. right. Now let the truth of God make something clear. We don't hate the homosexual person. That's right. oh, no. I am not homophobic. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Just like a crackhead. I don't hate the individual. No, sir. I'm dealing with the conduct and the deed. That's, That's right. it. That's it. I can show you Bible mm -hmm. where a man of God address homosexuals. That's right. As brother. That's right. That's right. Give me the book of Genesis. I want to give this Sodom and Gomorrah. Yeah. That's right. That's right. He addressed them as brothers. brothers. That's right. That's it, props. Take your time. Take your time. He didn't hate the man. No, no. But he was preaching against their deed. That's yes, right. he was. Man. I want to show you this. You know, I love to get Bible for all, all the good things, you That's know. Right. That's right. All right, son, let's go to work. Genesis chapter 19, and we'll start at verse 5. Give, give chapter and verse again. Genesis chapter 19, and we're at the fifth verse. Listen. And they called unto Lot and said unto him, where they are, called unto Lot and said to him, Where are the men which came into thee this night? That's the way America is. And let, let us, listen, let us not look at Sodom and Gomorrah as a place just of the past. That's right. right. Because the past also represents the present. That's, That's right. right. Amen. That's right. That's right. Because not only America fall under this scripture, mm -hmm. the whole world fall under this scripture. Amen. Amen. The whole world. The whole world. Yes, sir. Are you listening? Amen. Now, let me say in advance, mm -hmm. I don't know how long we're going to be on the station in Canada. That's right. That's I'm right. telling you right now. That's right. I don't know. That's right. 
And the reason why I say I don't know, because the law in Canada make it illegal to speak against homosexual. Amen. I don't care what law have it. That's right, Amen. Preach the word, sir. That's it. Preach the word. I have a command. That's right. That's right. Are you listening to the old man? Yeah. That's right. And God commands, yeah. preach the word. The, the word. Preach the word. God ain't tell me to preach for ratings. No, no. He didn't tell me to preach to be loved. No, no. Or to be accepted. That's right. He said, preach the word. Preach the word. So I don't know how long we're going to be on the station. <laughs> I don't know. Amen. But I'm going to preach the word. Preach the word. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you everything that God had me to tell you. That's right. Now let's look at this. And when they Give called, verse again. now in Genesis chapter 19 and verse 5. What happened? And they called unto Lot and, they said, called unto him, unto Lot and said to him, Where are the men which came into thee this night? Where are the men that we, we, we was watching? Bring them out unto us that we may know them. Now, they didn't want to know their name, their social security number, their telephone number. <laughs> no. They wanted to know their birth date. No. Mm -mm. No. That way it is written how Adam knew his wife. Mm -hmm. What you mean? He laid with his wife so children can come here. That's it. So they wanted to know the brothers, mm. the angels yeah. right. that came to be there with Brother Lot. That's right. Now I want you to look at how deeply the lust was. Bring them out unto us that we may know them. Bring them out unto us that we may have relationship with them. And Lot went out at the door unto them and shut the door after him. You see, he shut the door behind him. He didn't want to want to creep in. You know? That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. And said, I pray you. I pray you. Brethren. Brothers and brothers. Amen. He didn't, he, he didn't hate the men. No. Righteous man. He was focused on what they were doing. That's it. Do not so wickedly. He's focused on the deed. That's it. Amen. And what did he call the men? Brethren. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. So, to the homosexual brothers. brothers. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. To the homosexual brothers. Yeah. What do you mean, brothers? Because I don't care what you do. You a man. Still a man. Still a man. Bruce Jenner, you might as well put your track shoes on and run right back to your manhood. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Am I right, man? Yeah. Amen. <laughs> Bruce Jenner, you might as well put your track shoes back on and run right back in your manhood. That's right. That's it. That's it. Because you're still a man. Still a man. man. That's right. That's what man. you making out to be now? Oh Lord, help us! <laughs> you're still a man. Still a man. That's right. You see, the Bible says they change the truth into a lie. That's right. That's right. What is that lie? That breast is not yours. Yeah. Uh huh. That's a lie. Right. Those cheeks are not yours. That's right. Uh huh. That's, That's right. right. No. No. That's it. Change the kinds. Amen. What did you do? Mm -hmm. You breached your contract. Yeah. Right. Amen. Go ahead, guys. Go ahead. Sir. Now look how wicked this country is. That's it. Wicked they are. That's it. That's it. That's it. Interviews. Mm. Now he have his own reality show. That's it. Wickedness. Even change his name. My lord, my lord. And change his birth certificate. That's right. Mm. So says, suppose they sue, sue you. What do I do? I look like I care. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. You see, you viewers accept this mm -hmm. when a celebrity do it. That's, That's right. right. That's it. There's nobody more popular than God. That's Man. right. Man. 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 Nobody. Nobody. Man. So when a celebrity, mm -hmm. a rapper, Mm -hmm. A mm -hmm. entertainer, mm -hmm. talk show host, mm -hmm. a musician, an athlete, mm -hmm. a politician. Yeah. When they come out and sanction it, they pressure the judicial system of America. That's right. And now all you weak Bible toting preachers. Amen. Are scared. That's it. Amen. Are crumbling. That's it. 
You scared because you're getting subsidies from the government. Yeah. That's, right. That's, That's financing your federal program. That's right. That's it. I wouldn't care if we had a program and got a million dollars a week. Amen. We will never compromise for money. Amen. Wonderful. For nobody. Wonderful. 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 Let me make something very clear. We organize a nonprofit organization. Yes. It's called the Emmanuel Advancement Center, mm -hmm. the EAC. Yeah. And our program that we're putting together is designed to implement various programs to help community and church. Right. GED programs, mm -hmm. drug rehabilitation, right. female abuse, mm. child abuse. Mm -hmm. Job training. Amen. It, it will cover so many areas. But if there's one grant or one type of funding mm -hmm. that the government want to give us with the if attached. That's right. Oh, no. And that if have to do with our faith. Amen. We will pass up every penny Amen. and stick to the faith. Amen. We will not sell our soul to America no. for nothing and for nobody. That's right. Beautiful, beautiful. No reason. Are you listening? That's right. Let's read this quickly then I get the letter that we had done to the Supreme Court, mm -hmm. because we're dealing with a higher court than them. Oh, yeah. Oh, certainly, certainly. Pretty quick. And Lot went out at the door unto them and shut the door after him and said, I pray you, brethren, do not so wickedly. Behold, now I have two daughters which have not known man. Lot knew what to do. Mm -hmm. He even offered his daughters. Two daughters. What was he telling them? If you're going to do wrong, at least do it right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. That's I got two daughters. Lot is telling you, telling those men right then. Right there. The woman was made for the man. That's mm -hmm. right. Amen. So I got two daughters. I recommend them to what you, whatever you're going to do, do it with some women. That's right. Huh? That's right. Listen to what Lot says. I have two daughters. I have two daughters. Which have not known man. Not only do I have two daughters, but they're virgins. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me, I pray you, bring them out unto you. I'm willing to bring my daughters daughters and give them to you and do ye to Just them so you don't be with your own kind that's right i will give my own daughters to you that's right and when i give them to you i suggest and do ye that to you them do to them as is good in your eyes whatever make you happy only only unto these men to these men do nothing don't do this that's, that's right. what i'm saying <laughs> that's right. to the whole world that's right Men do nothing. When it comes to men, mm -hmm. what should you do? Do nothing. No, a little bit. <laughs> a little here and a little there. Nothing. Not even a kiss? Nothing. What about a hug? Nothing. Pat your backside? Nothing. Buy you some flowers. Nothing. That's a Hallelujah. That's right, sir. Do nothing, sir. That's do nothing. That's it, sir. That's right. All right, listen. That's right. All right, let's get the letter we sent to the Supreme Court. July and then the we'll get some other mail, God willing. Come on, Dan. July the 1st, year 2015. To the Chief and Associate Justices of the Supreme Court of the United States, we write this letter of concern over the recent ruling in which same-sex marriages are now legal and recognized in all 50 states. We are Assembly of Holiness, and as our tenets of belief are based upon Holy Scriptures, we must go on record as stating that we are in total disagreement with this ruling. We do understand that the ruling has been published and is available for public viewing. However, we would like to invite each of the justices to participate in a televised discussion with us so that you may each speak plainly on your views and thoughts which have led to this court ruling. As a country in which the official motto is, quote, in God we trust, we cannot understand how this ruling, which now impacts our entire country, can be in agreement with the very one who first defined marriage as concerning between a man and a woman. So you see, 
Either God is right in his manner or the court is. But this contradictory to herald in God we trust when we defining of our acts of marriage by the highest court in the land offers a direct challenge to the original author of it. We are aware that there were four dissenters in the ruling, Chief Justice Roberts, Chief Justice Scalia, Chief Justice Thomas, and Chief Justice Alasso, Alito, beg your pardon. And we recognize that their reasons for dissent may not be exactly the same as our reasons for disagreement. So we would also like to invite the justice who gave dissenting opinions to the aforementioned discussion to share their thoughts on the matter publicly. In closing, we would like to make mention of the chant which is stated at the opening of your sessions. It includes the words, quote, God save the United States and this honorable court. Are these words merely stated for th uh, uh, rhetorical purposes and dramatic pulls? Or do we all as a nation truly desire God to save us from the decisions and opinions which oppose the very one to whom we reference? God save us indeed. Mm. We look forward to hearing from you in hopes that we might have this open dialogue. You may contact us in, by the email address in the tele and telephone number given in the letterhead. Please also feel free to visit our website at www.truthofgod.com to learn more about our organization. We thank you in advance for your time and attention. Yours sincerely, Pastor Gino Jennings, General Overseer. <clears throat> this ruling directly challenge the wisdom of God. Yeah. That's right. Direct. God Himself. Yeah. Is the one that designed marriage. Amen. That's right. Not Barack. That's right. No. God's laws. Not the Supreme Court. That's right. That's right. For there was a courthouse, there was God. Amen. And God plainly said mm -hmm. that it was not good for man to be alone. Amen. And the Lord God said. Hallelujah to God. Amen. Do you hear? Genesis chapter 2, when we're at verse 18. What is it? And the Lord God said. The Lord God said. It is not good that the man should be alone. It is not good that the man should be alone. I will make him an I, help me. I, I will make him a help me. For him. For him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam and he slept. And what did he do? And he took one of his ribs and closed up the flesh instead thereof. Hold it right there. You know, and let me correct something right now because uh, doctors and them <laughs> that study the body says that, you know, a man have 12 ribs. I don't know how many ribs a man got. <laughs> but as a result of God taking one rib from Adam, mm -hmm. men have said to this very day that now every man only got 11 ribs. Uh, <laughs> every man is missing a rib. No. <laughs> as, as a result of that. Of that. The woman's here. They always make up something, don't they? That's right. Come on, son. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam, and he slept. And? And he took one of his ribs and closed up the flesh instead thereof. And the rib which the Lord God had taken from man... He made a man. Made he a woman. No, no, no. I got a handkerchief. You want to clean your glasses? <laughs> and the rib which the Lord God... You see, the Bible says, search the scriptures. Search the scriptures. And I, I'm just looking for justifiable cause yeah. for men to marry men. That's now, right. let me say to all you judges, mm -hmm. every judge in America and the world mm -hmm. that perform same-sex marriages, mm -hmm. you have performed an act of blasphemy. That's yeah. right. Yes, Everyone. Let me say it again. Mm -hmm. The marriages that you performed are mocked. Marriages. Oh, yeah. They are not authentic marriages. Mm -hmm. They are not real marriages. Mm -hmm. They are imitations. That's right. They are counterfeits. That's right. Counterfeits. 
Right. Are you listening? Amen. Learn. Listen at the book. Now in the wisdom of Solomon chapter 6 and at verse 1. It says what? Learn. Learn. Ye that be judges of the ends of the earth. Learn. You that be judges of the ends of the earth. Give ear. Pay attention. Ye that rule the people. That rule the people. And glory in the multitude of nations. What? <clears throat> For he which is Lord over all shall fear no man's person. Amen. Amen. Now to all the judges, mm -hmm. I want to say to the homosexual community, yeah. I don't hate you. And it really don't matter to me if you believe I'm not telling you the truth. That's irrelevant. That's irrelevant. All you men and all you women that's married to your own kind, mm -hmm. you're not married. No. You have not judged a right. Do you hear this? Now in the book of the wisdom of Solomon, chapter 6 and verse 4. What happened? Ye have not judged a right. You ain't judged it right. Nor kept the law. You didn't keep the law. Nor walked after the counsel of God. And you didn't walk after God's counsel. Mm -hmm. There is no real marriage in the world. That's right. Where you got two men and two women. That's that right. is not a marriage. That is mockery. mockery. In fact, you're making mockery of the law of marriage. That's right. Excellent, boss. Excellent. Can't be in marriage. That's why you can't even use the same language. That's it. No. You can't say I pronounce your husband and wife. No, do it to you, you, You're just changing. You're changing. You're changing. And God says you will change it. That's right. Changing the truth of God. You change the truth of God into a what? Into a lie. So they say I pronounce you partner That's right. and That's partner. Right. That's right. And some of the judges say I pronounce you wife. And wife. My Lord. And some judges say, I pronounce you husband and husband. Mm. Change the truth into a lie. You celebrities. You celebrities that watch the truth of God, mm -hmm. that condone same sex marriages. Mm -hmm. I don't care if the whole world love you. <laughs> Buy your CDs. Buy your albums, go to your concerts, mm -hmm. be interviewed all over the world. Yeah. You can have all the money you want. Mm -hmm. Not a dollar will keep you from standing before the judgment seat of God. Amen. That's right. That's right. Sir. That's certain. Sir. That's right. That is certain. Are you that rich to actually think mm -hmm. that your wealth? Mm -hmm. Amen. And your earthly prosperity yeah. impresses God. Amen. Go ahead, Fox. So foolish. You think God care who you are? That's, That's right. right. No respect to sir. Wonderful, sir. Wonderful, sir. Go ahead, Fox. Jay Z condone it. Yeah. But Jay Z is against it. That's, That's right. right. That's it, sir. That's right. Amen. His wife, Beyonce, condone it. Amen. But God is against it. God is against it. Wendy Wim, the talk show host, condone it. My Lord. God is against it. God's against it. Amen. Barack Obama condone it. Yes. God is against it. Amen. The Queen of England condone it. Amen. God is against it. That's right. Amen. I'm on the Lord's side. Sir. Wonderful, sir. That's right. Wonderful, sir. You that are watching, yes, you that is on the Lord's side, right. it is written, come to me. Wonderful, Pops. Be on the Lord's side. Wonderful. Be on the Lord's side. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Wonderful. We are on, on the, the Lord's, Lord's side. side. Wonderful. Hallelujah. Go ahead, Pop. Go ahead, sir. Wonderful. On the Lord's side. We're on the Lord's side. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Wonderful. Go ahead, Pop. Beautiful. Wonderful, wonderful. Satan yeah. has woven this homosexual spirit. Yeah. What it is. About the world, sir. About the world. Wonderful. Even put it in cartoons. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. Amen. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. To manipulate our kids. Yeah. That's right. Amen. Take your time. Sir. Go ahead, Pops. Go ahead. Preach it, Pops. Preach it. Wonderful, sir. Wonderful. We'll show two male cartoons. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Preach it, That's right, sir. Kissing. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Two male cartoons. Amen. Get married. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Mm. See if they use cartoons, it downplay the severity of it. That's right. That's right. Very subtle, sir. And make it more fair seeming right. and acceptable to children. That's, That's right. right. That's right. That's the serpent, sir. So the children right. will go to school mimicking That's right. what they saw Buzz Bunny do to Daffy Duck. Amen. Amen. That's the serpent, sir. 
That's it. Go ahead, man. Oh, the devil ain't called a serpent for nothing. That's right. Man. The media is a tool for Satan. That's right. That's right. God of this world, sir. Wonderful, sir. Oh, yeah. Through the media, yes, sir. marriages fall apart. That's right. Through the media, churches that fell apart. That's right. Through the media, man. they have turned on God man. and denounced him. Man. Wonderful. Go, go ahead, sir. Wonderful, sir. Wonderful. Wonderful. We use the media for one purpose. Right. Preach the gospel. Preach right. the gospel. Publish gospel. We ain't on YouTube to record me talking on the phone no, no. That's right. to somebody. No, that's right. To record me outside of somebody's church videotaping them. Yeah. We ain't got time for that trash. Go ahead. Lift him up, sir. Lift him up. Wonderful, sir. We over the air Lift. for one thing. Lift him up. Go ahead, sir. Go ahead. Preach the gospel. Amen. Amen. Turn them darkness to light. From darkness to light. Yes, from the power from of Satan. the power Satan. of Satan unto God. Unto God. Amen. Unto God. Go Hallelujah. Lift him up, sir. Publish it. Wonderful, sir. Go ahead. Wonderful. That's what we over the air for. That's right. That's right. We ain't over the air for nothing else. That's, That's it. Now. That's it, sir. That's the whole story. Every celebrity, every politician, that condone same-sex marriages, mm -hmm. you are not on God's side. I know. And you that claim you're Christians, mm -hmm. you're liars. Yeah. 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 There is no such thing, no such thing. as a homosexual Christian. No, no such thing. Oh, no. no. Let me say it again. No such thing. There is no, no, no such thing. thing. Amen. As a homosexual Christian. Amen. Amen. You may be homosexual and go to church. Mm -hmm. Christian mean I'm living like Christ. Amen. Right. Christ didn't lay with men. No, he didn't. That's right. That's right. No, he didn't. Amen. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. No such thing. No such thing. That's right. Amen. I even had some people left the truth of God. Because they felt as though I hit too hard. I had some so-called brothers yeah. said that, Pastor Jennings, you know, I know you're preaching the truth, but you know, but you you, you just kind of too rough yeah. on the homosexual question. Yeah. You got it. It takes a real man. Wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. To sit under this message. That's right. Wonderful, sir. Wonderful. You gotta be a real man real to take man. this. Real man. Amen. Real man. Yes, sir. Wonderful. Wonderful. Amen. Sister asked me one day, do you always got to talk about lesbianism? Mm. <laughs> I said, why? Do it bother you? Mm. Uh, 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 Lord. You see, it doesn't matter what's in you. Yeah. If you want it to come out, yeah. you got to be around the right stuff to yeah. get it out. That's right. That's it. That's right. got to be around this stuff. got to be around this stuff. There's something yeah. in everybody. Yeah. Yeah. That's right, but you gotta be around the right thing oh, yeah. to drive it out. That's right. That's it. That's it. Bob. Are you listening? That's right. They're around the fire. That's why you folk love the devil's churches. Amen. It ain't nothing coming out. Yes, Right. Preacher pacify you. Amen. Tell you what you want to hear. Amen. Tell you what you like to hear. Amen. You jump and shout that day. Amen. Because it ain't nothing coming out. Nothing coming out. <laughs> so in a in a way that these men try to retaliate, they say, Pastor Jennings don't have love. Yeah. Yeah. That's, an excuse. Excuse. That's an excuse. That's an excuse. I preach love. That's, That's right. right. God is love. Amen. And God is the word. Man. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So to the whole homosexual community, you're not married. Not married. No. Not married. You can marry all the men you want and you a man. That's right. Your license is just as good as a $3 bill, right. a $4 bill, a $7 bill. That's, right. That's how much value your license has. That's right. So you go around, you go on and flaunt yourself now. It ain't no brother or no sister should be at a gay parade. No way. Oh, no. No way. Oh, no. No way, sir. No way. That parade is full of spirits. Yes, it is. 
Yes, sir. And you'll mess around and get that spirit. That's right. Yes, sir. That spirit will follow you home. Yes, it will. Follow you to church. That's right. Yeah. That's it, sir. Oh, Am I right, I say? Amen. Yes, sir. Excellent, Father. Beautiful, sir. Wonderful. Excellent. Ye have not judged a right. You're not judging right. No, sir. Right. Nor kept the law. Amen. I'm telling you, we are at the end of all things. Amen. It's coming to an end. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. And this is why the word of God is preached harder and harder Amen. and harder. Amen. I remember one brother said to me some years ago, I'm going to pray that, you know, that you kind of ease up. I said, you might as well go find the biggest chicken and eat them. That's, that's right. <laughs> There's no easing up here. No, no. Amen. Amen. We're living in perilous times. Amen. And the devil's after our young boys and young girls. That's right. Hey man, you ain't got time to complain about me. No. You can turn television on, radio, and internet. All you hear is preachers talking about Pastor Jenny, Pastor Jenny. Don't waste your time preaching me. No. That's right, that's right. Complain about me. That's right. Complaining about me ain't gonna do nothing. I'm gonna stand on God's word after you're dead and gone. Amen. Amen. Amen.